The Conceited Nobody. Every Tuesday at 8 p.m. What's up, what's up, what's up? We back with another edition. Appreciate that. The best, the best podcast you ever had to see to nobody. You already know what this is, episode 137. A lot of motherfucking episodes, bro. Man, listen, we be cooking. Man. Yeah, we be out here cooking. Even though the shit been trying to stop us, man, get in the way. Niggas really be cooking. Shit. Mm-hmm. Listen, man, our nickname is Perseverance. It's just dudes. <laughs> hey, no real persevere. shit. I'm gonna tell you something. Make the best of the know, worst boys. I don't know nobody more consistent than any niggas that's like right here right now. Like yeah. you got no, you gotta think though. Despite of everything that's been going on, like niggas ain't really popped. Like niggas pop just enough to like float, but niggas ain't pop pop. Mm-hmm. So like the fact that niggas still being consistent and doing everything that we doing. Niggas would have been quick. You know what I mean? Shit. Niggas would have been stopped doing what they were doing. That nigga said a long time ago. Nigga would have been stopped a long time ago. Real shit, they ain't no exaggeration either. Nah, I'm going to tell you, um, I benefited from comedy being shut down. Cause Jason being here for so many straight weeks. <laughs> 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 Ain't that it? Ain't that it? That was selfishly thinking the other day. Listen, cause, cause the TCK always open. Wait, look. <laughs> in, the, in the moment you speak it, I was like, nigga, I'm finna be in somebody's yard for nigga in a week or two. <laughs> Listen, and I was okay with that because yards ain't that far from me. <laughs> look, I say to myself selfishly. <laughs> I hope they close this shit down again. A stringent, a stringent shut down. Yeah, they, can it, they can do it. They can do it. They can do it when it get cold. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I'm gonna tell you, we just like oh, hey, we man. like 50 episodes away from a million dollars. So I feel oh, hey, like, you know what I mean? like oh, but, but, but we need some motherfuckers. Yeah, we hey. need motherfuckers to show up. You know what I mean? Like y'all show up, nigga. If, <laughs> just, if Jason went back to comedy, I don't want to have that story. If the comedy world wouldn't open back up, if Jason was here. He was there. Yeah, I, mean, I got a show. I got some shows. <laughs> they, but they not on Tuesday. <laughs> yes, they is. Actually, oh, come on, somebody, somebody in that county has to die <laughs> for the greater good of being my life. You know, it's on a Tuesday too. <laughs> what, you going, what you got going on on Tuesday? Where is this at? It's oh, Iowa. 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 I know some cows. <laughs> I know some cows. We gotta go milk them bitches. What part of Iowa? Yeah, what part of Iowa? I don't know no other. Des Moines. Lies. Des Moines and um, Iowa City. I don't know no other cities. Come on, man. Look at the our familiarity real quick. You know, every city. Like, <laughs> I'm from city. Anderson City. Oklahoma <laughs> City. <laughs> Indiana City. Indiana City. You already know who it is. Latouris, a.k.a. The Blueprint, a.k.a. The Low Key Legend. To my right, we got Juby. Renaissance motherfucking Juby, the man who make it all happen. To his right, we got Chicago Jason. No, I'm Master Richie now, nigga. <laughs> That's my fucking What's that name. Mean? Listen, nigga went ultra instant. This I'm is master, the first. Nigga. Put that on record. What does that mean, if though? If he say Master Jason, I'm Master. That's master Richie. Why you Master Richie? Last master. nigga that nicknamed himself died in a helicopter with his daughter. I'm not saying What's, no. what, hey, what does it mean? I got so many AKAs, nigga. It's okay. Uh, no. Go ahead. Go what ahead. does it mean? Oh, it don't have no meaning for real, man. I just uh-huh. wanted to name one of my kids Master <laughs> so that everybody would have to, like his teachers would have to call him Master Richie. I named my son, sir, so you're going to call my I son, sir. You. Basically. Shout out to Jason. <laughs> I named yeah, my son, so. sir, so you're going to call my son, sir. <laughs> one of the hardest bars ever. Yeah. There you go. To his right, to you kiss. To his right, we got the. Uh, I don't even want to call you no guests no more. Would you twist it up? I've been here enough, nigga. Uh, Would you twist say it up again. last time you came? No, I'm about to say nah. I was out here from uh, uh, Raggedy Black Let you Let you Let you Hey, we appreciate you switching it up for yeah. the yeah. TCK yeah. podcast. I got you, baby. Mm-hmm. You know, you know, guests on. don't really do that shit. Like some guests come <laughs> back and like, damn, you look like the last episode. Like, you switch that shit up. <laughs> That's why I said he ain't like no guests no more. He a, he a relative. I know I look like the last episode, nigga. That look like a cartoon character in this bitch. Like, nigga, that's I'm the same last shirt. episode. I'm going to Photoshop your shirt. You know, you know, you know, you know, you know, Throw some fresh up. I'm going to carry You got to, like, do, like, a whole, like, audio and have somebody edit a cartoon. Like, you know, an hour, have somebody edit. I'll pay for that. You know what I mean? You're talking like that. Yeah, like, in a whole year, like, you cartoon. Like, we was cartoons. I know it a crack. 
But you know, I, how, I would do that though. Yeah. <laughs> I would do that. Cause though. that should be hard. That's how it should take too long. I, it would. It would. Take I, that's how you got find like a particular funny yeah, shit. Yeah, for show. sure. I want to give a quick shout out to the old input, nigga. We on the bigger and better things. Listen, we hey, moving man. on. That's the trophy. Hey, man, we gotta keep this thing going. Fucking like you just won it. I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use that to travel with. Nigga, if I go somewhere else, that's my traveling shit right there. Shout out to the task now. We are not getting paid for shout outs. <laughs> <laughs> but no, you know how it is. Another episode. That's why I had to throw this on because uh, I had this motherfucking. I ain't even about to tell them what I had on. And I had it on though. And we didn't get paid by the motherfuckers. So Matter of fact, hold on, hold on. We are going to do a bit of. I, I got a question for y'all before we get into our uh, topics. We're going to have a fantastic show. British Knights. Y'all ever own a pair? Yes. Have you ever wanted a pair if you didn't own them? I think I owned a pair and then I didn't okay, like them. Did y'all know they made a resurgence? I didn't oh, like them shoes, man. I, I was looking, I was about to order them. Remember the BK Ratchet strap? Yeah, shoes I remember ain't nothing without the BK button. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I was about to buy a pair of British Nikes and my ignorance took over me. You know what I said? What's that? These shoes are only $55. Well, I'll be laughed at. Do I have to buy shoes over $100 and shit to be official? Well, the nigga stopped me and say, man, that's $50 in your feet. Like, it, I'm going to ask y'all because I respect that. I'm okay to wear a pair of British Knights. Yeah. For nostalgia's sake. I yeah. mean, my nigga yeah. wore shacks. Yeah, yeah, hell that's, yeah. That's, that's despicable. Hell yeah. You wore that's man. despicable. I was about to say, nigga, you, you could have you could done worse. You get away, you you know get know away with it. Shacks are worse than Starberry. Star <laughs> Star <laughs> shacks are way oh, worse than I mean, they're on the same level. Star Star I mean, no, they're on the same cool. level, but. I got a pair of Starberries. I'm gonna wear some I'm more berries. Just to support. So I'm right, I'm gonna wear some. He had some. Uh, <laughs> the spinners on him. Yeah. Hey <laughs> <laughs> man, he's a fucking icon, right? In China, nigga. Who else y'all see eat Vaseline? <laughs> and, and and before the internet took off like it did, can you imagine that shit today? Who who's the equivalent to Stephon Marbury right now? Maybe uh, Chris Paul. Chris. Uh, oh, damn. Wow. For career wise, Chris Paul was better career, but I'm talking about like one of the. Best point guard. Shoes. Shoes. Oh, I'm talking about shoes. No, no, I'm talking about because if he was <laughs> under the nowadays, 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 if he was eating Vaseline, who, who would be in the NBA today equivalent of eating Vaseline to what Stephon Marbury was at that time? Shit, right, James Harden. Man. James Harden, way he's just a whole fucking <laughs> few levels above where Stephon Marbury was. Uh -huh. Stephon Marbury was near. Uh, what's a MVP? <laughs> <laughs> he said, "What's a <laughs> No, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm talking about. I'm talking about far as popularity, like they're. Accomplishments and shit. Ooh. Who a good point guard was it? Michael Conley. Yeah, yeah Michael Conley. Mike, Mike, ain't oh, no said, said Mike, Mike ain't an all star either. Yeah, Mike ain't never been an all star. But he, he he's only played an all star uh, That's tough. level, though. You said all star? Like yeah, level? like. I'm trying to think, man. That's oh, a good question. Man, I'm about to say, that is tough. I would say Jason Kidd, but no. Jason that's Kidd. that's like a Hall of Famer, first ballot, never. And, and we talking about right now, though. Stephon Marbury. You talking about like a Trey Young or some shit like that? Cause I'm talking about like what I'm talking about. Hey, like no, you talking about that career? Marbury was at when he was eating Vaseline. His level of oh, popularity. Oh shit! Um, who the fuck did he, he was still good, but like at the end of his career. Rod so Strickland. I go for that. Like, you know Rod Strickland ain't played twenty years. We talking about today, <laughs> nigga. <laughs> hey, well, we'll figure that out later. John Wall was an Olympian. Who? John Wall, but he ain't getting traded around. John Wall, that you know what? John Wall will be accurate. We don't say Rose. D Rose? Mm. Mm -hmm. For a minute, man, Jerry Rose was jacking up too. Yeah, he was talking but shit too. Derrick Rose is a former MVP. Yeah, 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 he did say that. But I'll go with John Wall. I'll go with John. Even a Kyrie. Well Kyrie. Nah, nah, nah. nah John Wall, John Wall. Wall. Kyrie. That's why yeah, I, I know, know, right? That's a good ass man. question. Kimba? <laughs> Definitely. Oh, Kimba. Definitely. Oh, Kimba. Yeah. Hold on. Even yeah. though Kimba has Kimba. long jet, more better than long jet. That's what I'm saying, though. I'm not talking about all the time. No, I'll give you somebody better. Yeah, Barry why? Davis. No, why Kimba, though? Remember Barry what, what, Davis? What part of current don't he get? <laughs> what part of current don't this nigga get? Man? Everybody you know is dead. Equivalent, nigga. <laughs> uh, listen. You said current, though. He, that, he, he don't know that shit. He don't hear current. Nigga, that's current for us still, nigga. That's like, that's BD. Right. Like they said, Anybody say, anybody say 10 years ago, I'll mag, we go back to the 90s. Right. <laughs> 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 hey, for real, though. That's funny. 
That's sad. It's fucking pathetic. <laughs> we trapped in the 90s. Baby. But look, it though. It's right, though. It's rightfully so. On everything. We're talking about, though, our recap of the Leak Awards. We're going to recap the Leak Awards. We're going to talk about Con Yeezy versus Harriet. And we also going to talk about, uh, what, what, I can't, what the fuck did I say? What was it? It's crazy. It's in the talking time. about Free Britain. <laughs> we gonna matter of fact we're gonna talk about Nick Cannon being modern day buck broken. We witnessed a buck breaking episode oh, they did take talking. place. But what what what, what y'all lead off with? What, what let's kick off with the leak awards. Leak yeah. awards took place, yeah, took place this past weekend. Uh, the nigga said yeah, we <laughs> It took place this last weekend. It happened. At the at the Silver Center, it happened to us. <laughs> it happened. didn't just happen; it happened to yeah. us. We were a victim of the Leak Awards. Niggas hey, like oh, it's a, a bunch awards. of old offers in this motherfucker. First <laughs> off, first off, ain't that a bitch? How dare you? Should You've I'm been there two? before. I'm over two. Okay. okay. But first off, let me, the Leak Awards took place this past Sunday at the Silver Center in Indianapolis, Indiana. It's an annual award show presented by the Leak Magazine. They have like twenty. Categories. I'm running through the categories just to uh, mention the winners. Music video was Marco 5K, Facts, Author, Stacey House, DJ Ready Rock, Makeup Artist, Brianca the Mua. Mua. What do you say when you get a. Mua. Yeah, no, that. The makeup artist. Um, is that what M U A is? Yeah. Okay. Makeup, yep. Damn. Slap on Artist, Wild Child. I fucking hate that dick name. Wild child. Oh, that's somebody's name. That was a nigga who one came through with them braids and shit. He was the only one who had a civil. Oh yeah, he was the one who respected the only one who had a good speech. Yeah. Nail tech, cat nail Deshin. Original digital content. Who beat us was the Black Widow podcast, and I'm going to speak more on that in a few. Album skip. You for you. That's the name of the album. You for you. Graphic artist. OTB graphics. Wait, there was that. Actual album or was it skit? It was album. Oh, okay. Um, graphic artist, OTB Graphics, Barber, Killer, the female barber. Uh, what was her name? Killer. K I L L A. I'm sure her father hates that shit. I bet, I bet she came up there with boxes with dick hoes in them. I guarantee you. Probably, <laughs> I probably, I'll King. guarantee you. I'll guarantee you her bitches were happy for her. It's probably, she probably like, it's King. No, 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 no. Song, Macro 5, Facts. Marco for I hope I hope my wife fucking these names up. Marco <laughs> Five. Hey, Marco. Female artist Paris Ladane. Paris bartender Lane. Indies Black Barbie. She's a strip. That's what the boy. That's what the move is. All the female rappers is a strip. That's where they Cardi go. Bill. You already got to get somebody who's dejected. You know what I'm saying? Who already don't give a shit about being shit bag. Uh, bartender. No disrespect to <laughs> shit bags. Hold on. A bartender got a fucking reward. Indie Black Barbie. You I said bartender. That's what yeah. she, she won the bartender of the year. Elite. Yeah. Of the leak. Yeah. Now they can't, what's up with the comedy? You know, finish That's these what categories. We're going to attack all this yeah, shit. Finish this shit, bro. Uh, retail store B Bella. Uh, I'm not familiar with that retail store, but I wouldn't be familiar with a B Bella retail store. So well, food trucks included in that, too. Listen, everybody's going to die. Be patient. <laughs> <laughs> Videographer, Rose 4K. Not to be confused with Rick, confused with Rick Ross. Cool R and R extreme weeds, braids, braiders, Tokyo sweet style. This is the most niggerish awards ever. When you go and doing bartenders and hair braiders. Um social yeah, media personality, Keyonce, aka. Yeah, bro. I was I refuse <laughs> to read the second part. I was trying to figure You're it out. You talking about Big Kid. I just ran into that. <laughs> big Kid. I just ran into that. You uh, but that's what they replace. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they replaced the comedy. That's what they replaced the comedy with. With oh uh, yeah, so with the, with the social media. Listen, we don't pack Hold on, but name off the people that was in that category. They don't have it. Mm. Not on on this this winners list. Oh, okay. Uh, breakout DJ DJ Mary Jane, promoter Tedra Cardi. You would have said it for me, T. Yeah, What's worse, Ted or Tedra? What's worse? He must have just added the Rick to it. Man, I ain't want to shit on bro. nobody. Man. I'm no longer Big yeah. Willie. Call me William. <laughs> I'm <laughs> damn near not even Cedric, nigga. I'm just saying. Well, everything. Uh, <laughs> clothing brand Poverty Sucks. Poverty Breakout sucks. artist Ray Bands. Producer Fresh Does It. Photographer 
through her lens, event venue, or what a surprise, the Silver Center. Uh, male Did artist. It? <laughs> <laughs> and, 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 and without, without no shade, it is a nice venue. It was yeah, it's a nice venue. Male artist, Polo Boy Nunu. That's what's her name, son? Polo Boy Nunu. Who? Polo that's, Girl Nunu? That's a Keyonce. Uh, <laughs> you for real? Yeah. He what looking like? I don't know this I mean, He looking like. We just going off name. Can you imagine? Can you imagine the, the joy in her house that the mother and son both won a league award? Can you imagine? This has to be like when Ken Griffey Jr. saw his father in right field when he was in center field. Or Barry and uh, Bobby on the same bench for the set. Can you imagine if you were on stage, Jason, following your mother <laughs> on the comedy <laughs> stage? Can you imagine the accomplishment you would feel? Can you imagine the glee she must have to realize she raised her son to win a league award? <laughs> That is some accomplished shit, right? Can you imagine that shit? Like on TV, on TV, right next to the single mother picture. Y'all got your legal cords. Hey, my shit right there next to Jesus picture on the mantle, bro. That's, that's where they going. Do you take the Jesus picture down and put your legal <laughs> order up? <laughs> who will take presidents in this situation? Right next to Obama plates. Hey, David <laughs> Koresh on your legal award. I don't know. Like I said, I don't, I don't know. know. Don't get mumble no. mouth now, nigga. You should have told me it was her son if you didn't want to. Hey, no, I'm just no, saying. Hey, hey. Uh, only, reason, only reason why I'm not going to really top 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 on her top like that. It's not on her top. No, I'm not. But, yeah. like, only reason why because, like, she just lost her father. And her daddy, she used to make the little skits with her pops. Yeah. Uh, the Keyonce chick. Oh, okay. She make the skits with her pops. Her, yeah. her dad was, like, a legend. That nigga's hilarious now. We could pull. We should have really pulled some of that shit up. And her daddy is hilarious. I'm not disrespecting her daddy. No, no, no. I'm, just, I'm, just saying, I'm, I'm not going. I'm not really jumping on her. Topic. She's a social media and and personality. No. When you, your personality. Yeah, we laugh at Kanye. We laugh at everybody. <laughs> she won a fucking award. She's up next. <laughs> you know what I'm oh no, I was saying, ain't no, ain't no hate on the on the women. Nah, it's yeah, just like her. Yeah. It just was when yeah. he was there, nigga, and looking at this shit. He's like, did we win? Like, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> hold on, I got something for that. I was, like, I was a little bit more, I was a little bit more dialed in than the motherfucker was. I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm gonna go through my, all my emotions. Uh, mixtape DJ Don Don, fitness brand, Don weight drip. Come on, what? Fitness, what? Brand. Weight drip? Yes. Fitness brand. Oh, brown lash artist Andy Minx. Lashes? Oh. <laughs> Is he side? Watch the square yeah. mall, nigga. Lashes. Listen, nigga, they don't give a shit about your Lashes. comedy. Lashes. They don't give a shit about your comedy. Lashes. They don't give a shit about your comedy. Lashes. They had best host or something. You said, no, they didn't. I thought they did. Did yeah, they? Yeah. They did have something similar. There's something like that in there. Anyway, they had Star and uh, Willie out there hosting, look like Timon and Pumbaa. <laughs> 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 hey. That nigga be out there looking like her assistant. Actually, he be out there looking like her assistant, man. I don't know That's how that nigga be out there looking like he, he, like he carry her fucking sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> he went to get the cheesecake. He went across the bridge. On, on, the, on the top of the hat. Nigga. They, but they, they, I'm, I'm being funny, you know, because they definitely got good synergy. Uh, they been working together. They work, they, they work together a lot. Can tell. They built for that shit. You can tell mm -hmm. that they... They did what they could do under the circumstances. It was for uh, sure. Uh, first off, I'm gonna kick it off with the menu. Let's, I start, said let's, the do, menu. let's do the oh good, the bad, and the good. Let's see what's good. Because y'all was there, you know yeah. what I mean. I'll give you my personal experience when I went. I'm gonna let you go start off with the good because I'm a negative motherfucker. Okay. You gonna put this shit on me, really, Bobby? <laughs> okay, <laughs> so, okay. I start with the good part. Well, oh, the Nobody good. got shot. Okay, all right. That is a good. That's, that's actually great. Yeah. Good. And it was on the east side, too? Yeah, that's the best thing, I think. That's, the, that's probably about it. <laughs> no, good. I mean, everybody was there dressed, looking nice. Yeah, everybody. Looking like, it was peaceful. Yeah, that was good. That was great. Uh, like, the atmosphere. The only good. bad part of being dressed, I saw one person with a ridiculous outfit on. Would you like yeah. to elaborate? Would you like to yeah. work today? <laughs> this is how you look yeah. 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 Everybody was fucking. Everybody was dressed nicely, but there was this one, one nigga, nigga that looked like a black, like a mixture of like it was Blade in a Wild Wild West. Or, like this or, nigga or, had or Luke Cage. Luke Cage. Or Luke Cage. This Ooh. nigga had a. If chaps was a jacket, I, nigga. I, 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 <laughs> he was. 
I said, if Chaps was a, a leather Chaps. jacket, nigga, man, this nigga had a sleeveless, long leather, like, was it a gap? What the fuck was it? It was a man was showing off his biceps. The front of that bitch was cut out. Hold on, see, what? <laughs> Of the best. Why like, ain't getting no pictures of shit, man? Cause he look Cause like we been caught you fucking taking pictures yeah. on the phone. Nigga, I been like, bro, let's come and get a picture. We was already <laughs> sitting five feet away from the nigga gunning this nigga, like yeah. just roasting the shit. Bro, it would end up a fight. I would, I would have been like, man, you know what I mean? You nominated, I'm nominated, nigga. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we didn't have that iron. Hey, he like he called he old niggas young blood. Yeah, like he walk into Morgan Freeman like, hey, man, you young blood. I heard That's you was talking about. And you gotta be like, man, don't be telling me what you heard, nigga. You know what he's talking about. You see this jacket? <laughs> this nigga like, he should have had some spurs on. One of his, I think he rode a horse. <laughs> <laughs> I think he rode a horse in the venue. But look, though, all those saw it. Uh, it was a good, nice event as far as. Very ve nice venue. Mm. Fantastic. Very nice venue. Uh, gotcha. And it was a decent turnout. So a good a couple good performances that we saw. I will not co-sign that. Who performed? Because I didn't see a performance. Your boy performed. The one nigga that brought the band up there, there and then packed this shit up. This they packed their shit up like uh, color purple. Like, oh, first to go. The fuck, we here to get to the bad if, if it is bad. Now, I'll just oh, call no, it the truth. Well, okay. What else? That was it. I think that was now, it. He said, I think that was it. <laughs> That's what pissed me oh, about. <laughs> I ain't pissed off. We ain't even, I'm, we ain't I'm even exaggerating. <laughs> we ain't bullshit. Cause, all right, the good, bad come down to perspective. If I remember something else good, we can come back to it. Go yeah. ahead. Yeah. <laughs> the, 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 food. Food. the tacos was nah. okay. Those tacos are okay. The chicken meat was good. They, they didn't have no water. They didn't even cook the fucking shells. <laughs> the water was warm. Mama, my mama hungry. Ah. Go in there in the refrigerator and get some tacos. Nigga. And you five and can't cook. That's how we ate. Uh, right. They cook. charge up for the food now that they Okay, yeah. listen. Now, I know what you want to do. So we gonna, we, gonna, we gonna indulge you. First of all, we gonna go straight to the so-called band. It's the social distance shit. They hired niggas to say, wear your mask. These niggas was mask bullies. Really? So fucking aggressive. Like once you get in and shit, you cool. Once you sit down, you sit but you out in that hallway, nigga, you liable to get fucking shot. Right. You do not let niggas police niggas. <laughs> this how come? This was a microcosm <laughs> of black policemen and shit. This why we dare I say we need some nervous white man in here. <laughs> we need to, to make me feel up. These niggas was mass bullies. I'm like, you doing this for twelve dollars an hour? Mass like, and wristband bullies. They they checked Tracy because Tracy was nigga. Oh nigga. when I came in, I left out and to go see the bad food options which we'll get to. So I gotta go live. So, 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 nigga, I'm, I'm coming back in the room, right? This nigga hit me with a he put his fist out. I'm in the, I'm in the, he hit me put his fist fire. out, nigga. And uh listen listen to what Jason is telling He put his fist out, nigga, and I'm like, oh okay, I can try to doubt him. Thought you had a friend, did you? This nigga like, no, nah, no, nah, I was looking for your wristband. Where your wristband at? And I'm like, hey, nigga, you don't get your ass out of here. Left me hanging. He was like, oh, you can still get that little. I'm like, man, get your ass out of here, man. You just get the love, nigga, for the fuck, for the hook. Get out of here, man. Oh, they had niggas with felonies checking each other. Pretty much. It, it, was, it was sad, but look at the Niggas food with ankle pistols. The food. First off, man, the shit was supposed to, red carpet was supposed to be at six. Show was supposed to start at seven. I pulled up thinking there was going to be a red car out there, lights flashing. I was Which, ready. We, it was a strip of red carpet on the side with a leak. So you seen the picture. Mm -hmm. And that was the red carpet. That was the red carpet that was right it. there. For real? That was it. Dead, dead serious. So, um, I ain't even have time to take a picture. Can't even get three niggas lined up to take a picture. Hey, look, man, hey, look, man, man. <laughs> hey, look, man. It was raining like a motherfucker that day, man. It, it stopped raining when we had pulled, first had pulled up. So they had the indoor red carpet, nigga. And they could have had a little bit of a longer red carpet. Right, cut some vinyl out. Yeah, they could have. <laughs> nigga, he said cut some vinyl. Yes, yeah, so I'm about to say get some tape or something. <laughs> so they started about 8.30. We was hungry. I, I purposely didn't eat earlier that day because I'm about to. I had saw the online menu. I said, "This is an easy shit. Don't give me some fucking." Chicken support wings. black business. I'm, I couldn't wait to support these <laughs> colors. So look, <laughs> so I um, 
I get there, my stomach was like grumbling. And I was like, I'm about to fix you, stomach. How dare you grumble with all this delicious food just waiting on us to eat? <laughs> so Jason go up there and shit to get the grub. Jason came back grubless. <laughs> this nigga came back with a makeshift menu. A menu and a half. This nigga had a menu. <laughs> Can I name the shit? Listen, this is where Nate takes over because this is what really amused Nate and why he wants to hear the bag. You saw the menu? Yeah, I got the I menu. Saw, yeah, I saw, he was going to post it. Yeah, I was going to post it. Yeah. Told me, yeah, I pushed out. Yeah. So I looked at this menu, my nigga. First of all, <laughs> <laughs> I got, I got hyped when they had it to me. I'm like, y'all got all this? They was like, oh no, give me that back. Let me circle what we do got. It's my fucking now, hold on. Listen to what the fuck Jason go, just go said. Hold on, let me go no. live. Okay. Let me go live, bro. Let me go live. Bro. <laughs> this, this, this live. Hey, let me oh, tell I didn't care no more, bro. <laughs> fuck it. Fuck it. You been to these places before? Nigga, I went. I, the, the time I went, all right, so when I went, this is probably like three years ago. Oh, you talking about the League Awards? Yeah, the League Awards. I've been, I did, we done a, uh, a show up there. Oh, okay, so, uh, no, I thought I was just talking about the out shit. We, okay. did a show, we did a show up there, and it was actually a great turnout. Now, this is the funny part. It's a nice venue. Great it's venue. a nice ass venue. So, this is the funny part. So, when we walk in, they say, like, all right, I can go in y'all's green room. I'm like, oh, we got a green room. Mind you, you know what I mean? It's three openers, of course. Them niggas. We get in our green room. First thing I I'll notice, man, we got great value chips, great value dips. <laughs> GV party. And some, uh, some, uh, I didn't even know Tito's had like a great value. Nigga. We had some great value goddamn vodka. Tito, oh. <laughs> we had great value that shit. So I'm like, okay, that's our green room. You feel me? You know what I mean? We over here just like, yeah, nigga, this is cool. And shit, I'm taking pictures. I'm like, nigga. This is nice. Mm -hmm. I walk next door because we get to meet th with these niggas. These niggas got all the shit, bro. They got the buffalo wild wings, Who did? pizza wings. Uh, it was uh, wild Carlos wild Miller. Wild. It was okay. Carlos Miller, DC Young Fly, wow. and, uh, and, uh, and uh, Chico Bean. Yeah. These niggas all, they shit was just so set up. They had the bitches coming in and out, getting autographs and shit. Like all that shit. I just walked in and was like, hey, my name's Nate. Hope you guys have a good show. I was like, y'all might about to get a little chicken. They like, nigga, eat the whole box, bro. It's good, nigga. We they overfed us. We over here getting hit and getting our dick sucked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hold on. Hey, 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 girl. Hey, come here. Let me, I want y'all at my nigga. Like, hey, that's my girl, nigga. Your bitch walk out. <laughs> right. It's cool. Hey, what's going on, man? Oh, yeah, go. you mean you can get it? Damn, I'm <laughs> you, you didn't tell you do the, uh, the, the janitor across the hall? <laughs> <laughs> that ain't nothing but no little food, nigga. We about to go fuck these bitches. That's what they was worried about. They were for chicken we got bitches. Ah! <laughs> but anyway, continue. They did a spam, bitch. I spilled podcast wrong too. They did it so foul, man. So look, man, we walk. Hey, I'm like, man, shit, y'all mind we can get like a little chick. He's like, man, fam, over here, man. He give me the hand me the churches. I'm like, y'all niggas got churches. Chicken? That's when you I knew you were better than them niggas, didn't you? Look. At that point, you knew you was better what, than them, didn't you? That nigga, them niggas had churches, yeah. pie pies, buffalo, wild wings. Oh, they had them. all of them. Okay. It was level. All of them! It was level. And, and, and look, but the nigga don't hand me churches. I just said it was level. I just said it was level. They straight up looked at me. It was like, hmm. We don't churches. know. Churches, nigga. Here you go, my nigga. <laughs> and it's Tuesdays, so but here you get the two for the two four dollar nineteen, nigga. The mystery meat. All grease. <laughs> All grease and crust, <laughs> nigga. Going off grease and dandruff. Oh, what they gave us, nigga. Going off in judgment. Hell yeah, man. I'm <laughs> telling you, bro. But the the the, the place is phenomenal, though. Yeah. Like, it's Was not, it at the Silver Center? It was at the Silver Center. Okay. Yeah, the new one. You know they used to have the old one. Yeah, on the west side. Oh, nah. Mm -hmm. It was on the east side too. It wasn't over there off of Lafayette. I don't remember the one off of Lafayette. Uh, mm, what was it on the east side? What was it was, uh, I think it was peaceful. <laughs> I'm curious for it. Nah, I'm sure it was peaceful, yeah. but the one on the east, the other one on the east side, all right, on like Pendleton Pike. Yeah. You take the Pendleton Pike strip before you get to uh, Sunnyside. Yeah. It's like right over there on the left. I know you're talking about on the left hand side. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know exactly. Nice Across the Walmart. Get yeah, yeah. yeah, real. You know, it was nice too, but it was just way smaller. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Oh, you know I mean, no yeah. parking for shit. Mm -hmm. So that's that's why that's the night you used to get. Like she came shit. up. She she came yeah. up. She shout out to her. She I don't know what she did. Well, who? Knocked a couple niggas out. Probably. Mm -hmm. 
He said no. she stump a couple niggas out. He see he'll say that, but he won't mention the menu. Let's talk about the menu. <laughs> <laughs> so he goes up to the menu. <laughs> All right, man. Pull up the How menu. was the food last time you went? The food last time it was just because it was like sweet thirty eight. It was immaculate. It was just wings. Now let's and fries, take into consideration man. we are in the midst. But it was the like sweet thirty eight wings and fries. We are in the midst of a pandemic. Now let's give them that yeah, consideration. Yeah, I ain't even going. Yeah, you know, you can't hold them like that. We missing. Nah, this is I had to mention this shit. Fuck them. I'm holding them to the highest fucking, because they had a moment. They had some time, nigga. Mm. They got some ants who could have fried some fucking chicken. <laughs> was that all they had was fried? They had fries and wings, and bro, they was going crazy. Cause the niggas was That's already... all we asked for. But look, so, though, because so, if, yeah. if, if you ever went to Sweet 38 on a Saturday night or a Friday night when you get twisted out there, you gonna be waiting in line for the wings, like you damn near passing up the hoes for the wings. The wings be fired. You know, mm-hmm. you get five big dumbass wings, some little steroid wings. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you, know, you know, you think you eat meat, but you eat the You eat the veins and shit. Nah, that motherfucker. That shit Hold on, good. you gotta pause there. You don't eat the veins. You gotta pause there. Hey, I, 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 I was drunk. I, no, you gotta pause there. Yeah, that shit like a musket. That's the chick. Do she eat the veins, nigga? You don't. You ever mention eating the veins? What's your eat a man around me, nigga? <laughs> Go ahead. But yeah, that's yeah. all they had though. Wings and fries, bro. And the shit was fire. It was just a regular. It, it so fast like a regular forward. Night. Fast forward to this year. So fast forward to yeah. It all started with Kobe in that crash. You ever been down here ever since? <laughs> <laughs> We've been lucky to get them wings. Blessed. Hold on. That's so, all we was looking for. Hold on, man. So read off that menu, bro. <laughs> The, what, the, what it was supposed to be? Right. Read it it Should have, could have, would have been, man. You read, 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 read it up, I think. I'm, I'm you the kid. fact that, hold on, but look though, the yeah. dessert because they had hostess, right? So you had a server and whatnot. Yeah, yeah, that's no. all. No, you see, see, it, no. It, 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 oh. See, no server. See, this is the thing about it. Go back there and hold. See, I discovered. Yeah. I thought it was a server because I seen a young lady bringing people stuff at their table. Okay, look, the food run. This is what they had under meats: one meat, two sides, fifteen ninety nine. Kids meal. I should have knew it was fucked up then. I should, cause it was no fucking children allowed in the venue. I should have asked questions. I actually didn't see kids meal on this motherfucker. I didn't know it was no children around. And so no I should have knew something was awry then. <laughs> Barbecue ribs, oxtail, smothered pork, smothered chicken, meatloaf, pot roast, meatballs, fried catfish, wings, naked awesome. awesome. honey, barbecue, buffalo, garlic, parmesan, a little bit of toppings, uh, chitterlings. Oxtail, black shitterling. Back ribs. I can read. (laughs) Back ribs and smoked brisket. Back ribs. Listen. Listen. (laughs) This baby. Not baby, nigga. This back ribs. The ribs in the back. (laughs) They was trying to keep they trying to keep they trying to keep uniform. They want back and then baby into two different lines. We can't put baby on that motherfucker. Listen, listen. Listen. They said hot dog no, sandwiches, salad. Listen, this is what I should have knew, man. Yeah, breakfast. Yeah. I swear I didn't see this Sunday, nigga. Breakfast. Breakfast? Hey. French toast, pancakes, waffles. I didn't see this shit, did you? Nah. Listen, man, I think this. I think you photoshopped this shit and sent it back to me. <laughs> nah, they nigga. Said, listen, they said drinks. This is probably the most outstanding part of the whole menu. Anyways, <laughs> tacos. I, I, after all that, this is what they had. Smothered pork chops, mother chicken. This 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 shit. Shit. I still didn't see But you got to tell, you gotta tell nigga. No, no, no. The hostess came up there and she just circled the shit. No, he took it up there and they said, Look, nigga, don't bring this shit over here. I'm sure, you, I'm sure we, we got. This My nigga swore. Really I don't know what a back is. Baked macaroni and cheese, cabbage with smoked sausage. Who at the fucking war shit eating <laughs> cabbage and <laughs> <this> smoked sausage? <laughs> Bro, and I sent the shit too. I was like, damn, I'm looking at my little measly tacos. Like, shit. damn, I wish I would have got that cabbage. You got the taco? <laughs> Listen, they said they had sweet potatoes. Now, I'm going to tell y'all what the fuck really happened. Sweet potatoes. They had some uh, beef and chicken tacos. Seven layer salad. Seven layer? That seven layer salad, nigga. Listen, listen, listen. And the only drink they had was Kool Aid. Really? <laughs> outside, outside the bar. Kool-Aid. Outside the bar. They had Kool Aid. Listen, Kool-Aid. I've never been to a place that sold Kool Aid. Kool Aid is some shit they just got and you get it out the fridge. Right? Kool Aid like water, bro. Like that shit. Every niggas didn't even like go to like grab, like the squeeze and just squeeze and shit. <laughs> I would have been, I would have been, I would have preferred to squeeze it, nigga. For I, I'd have preferred, I'd have preferred to just, I'd have been bothered. I would have yeah, preferred if you kept Sunday dinner left over at home. <laughs> but, <laughs> that's what this equal, nigga. Go back to the meats, though. 
Because everything that was smothered was available, but the shit that wasn't smothered wasn't available. You couldn't get it not yeah, smothered you neither, nigga. Get it smothered. You couldn't get no plain chicken no pork chop. That shit came you know, smothered. That's not chicken that's not suffocating. Is that what it say? So look, so, wipe it so off. the menu was shit. <laughs> Down to the awards, because we done wasted a lot of time on this wasteful event. <laughs> if I'm being frank. They, they got the, they started late. And, and like the, you just a bitch just walked up and said the winner is and we didn't even know the fucking shit started. <laughs> the bitch said the winner is and I'm like what who? And they got the first category yeah. first. It was some old ass preacher on here. They had some old ass nigga oh, who man, had one of my favorite parts of had, life. Listen, he had I fuck my granddaughter written all over his face. <laughs> that nigga was creepy to me, man. That nigga Did was he had that vibe. He definitely had like a weird, like, oh you young tender on it. Exactly. <laughs> like <laughs> nigga. It looked like he spent some like he spent some money that night. I legit felt like it was like a a, a Randy Watson like sexual chocolate. Oh, like, I felt man. like it was like sexy chocolate. He, 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 he said so much on. rambling. He said, "I'm gonna tell you something." After like a video of himself, he came on stage. Listen, he, he got a lifetime like, to a video. I think so. I think it was like for being the nigga who ain't there missing no Sunday in the church award or some shit. <laughs> but the nigga they put a video up and I'm like, man, that's pretty cool. I wonder how he died. Right, well that's what we think. And like, then the nigga walked up and said, this here. nigga rose on the third day too. <laughs> I was fucking fucked up. So he's he, not expecting it. He go up there and he rambling. This nigga get talking about some shit that happened in 1987. Name he dropped the Farrakhan to Martin Luther King and shit. Casually. <laughs> yeah, God was talking to Farrakhan. <laughs> shit like that. Then he get talking about some the Black Lives Matter shit. How to be. You know, y'all, y'all give me so much spunk. Your young people out here, y'all out there march. I said, man, I didn't come here for this. I came here for a good time. I did not come here to think about George Floyd. You know what I'm I was not there for that shit. Then. That shit got mad uncomfortable though with for everybody because everybody was in that bitch drunk, turned up and shit. Like nigga yeah, this nigga, this nigga, this nigga up. turned to an NAACP fucking bonfire. And wasn't even informative or nothing neither. Like nothing. it was nothing like motivational out of it. It was different. Like it was I didn't want to go hit no white people inside the head. <laughs> <laughs> he served no he purpose. He didn't inspire riot or inform us oh, about yeah. anything. I hey, yeah. under my breath just for the sake of not having to fight my way out. I said, all oh, lives matter. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> he, he drove me to it. I didn't come in there with that fucking feeling. He drove me to it. You piece of shit. So look, though. <laughs> all Joe saw they get announced and shit. They going category to category. And they got a projector screen with like the names of the small corner, it was like who up for, to win and shit. And they said the digital media, I kind of perked up because for some reason I feel like a winner. I have my motherfucking Scarface glasses on, my fucking Fisher. Hat. I see the Fisher hat, bro. So you only break that out when you got shows and shit. Huh? You only break that out when you got shows and shit. Listen, man, I'm a t-shirt and sweat cutter. Right. <laughs> but when the occasion calls, right. the only thing I miss was my eye candy. That's what I was missing. So look. We in this motherfucker. And and they said the digital media content. I said, oh, that's the category we in. I said, what's up, what I'm gonna say when we win? And then they said, speak. I was like, I'm gonna go thank the most high. If I say you who they know what I'm talking about, do you even give a shit about a legal war? <laughs> so it's all this shit going through my head. I'm like, am I gonna call a nigga that to a bitch ass nigga in my ear? Like, what up? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna win. And then the screen went dark. And they said, we, the computer out. So we can't put the. So I said, oh, for your category. Listen, so the category. So they said, well, we don't know who all the nominees was, but we give you the winner. Uh, <laughs> I didn't even get the courtesy of seeing TCK on the like, fuck. Nobody knew we y'all. Nobody knew we was not. I didn't get the courtesy of. They were putting me on the screen like this. Like, nigga, you ain't got the paper. You ain't got the motherfucking transcript of this shit. So right, so right when they got to the, the, the only, only fucking category. Uh, the only, listen. And, and, and after that, that shit it came that. right to fuck on no, right it No, it, it, it fucked up with like one or two other people, but like, like, not consistent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit supposed to be like that. Listen, uh, and, black, <laughs> and, and for the record, Black Widow Podcast won. And I didn't feel that what fucked up that they won Black Widow podcast, but they not the same kind of podcast we are. They got a serial where it's like a show. Mm-hmm. They got a lot of buzz. So I didn't feel as fucked up losing to them. 
But just being I'm a competitor, I said I hope Nikki Neptune don't win. <laughs> that was only so much I was about to get for the rest of the night. I said, shit. please let Tyron win. Kanye. <laughs> Cause I didn't want nobody to be happy. <laughs> I was Ooh, I hope nobody win. Oh, I hope. Uh, yeah, I kind of hope this motherfucker fall apart tonight. Like, what? <laughs> is this silly fan loose? Is this silly? Fan? I was dramatic, nigga. I was like, man, happy nigga, you was upset. I nigga. felt real white. <laughs> I know. I, I know what the greater good is. All right. Half these people die. Let it tell about it, and I'm gonna get interviewed. <laughs> TC cable links. Shit happened. And I was hoping shit would happen. Look, he tell the trooper shit, man. I was just praying, hoping not to the man I'm high that these niggas would die, and then it really happened. So this is what prayer happened. works. Prayer works. Prayer works. Prayer works. <laughs> no, but all, all bullshit aside, I was very disappointed in how the presentation was. Like when you do shit like this, you supposed to run through it. You supposed to make sure you got because this it's your event. It's your staple. It's what you lead up with your magazines the whole year to where everybody looking forward to what you do. Was you're Ladina doing. actually there? Yes. Princess Fiona, Bill, bitch. Let me tell you. <laughs> I forgot. I'm outside trying to get the tickets and shit. I keep saying my name. It's not a TCK podcast. And this bitch over here talking about some. Let me see the email. That was her. Man, she over there was down there bullying. Ah, uh, that was she her. She all over aggressive. I'm like, bitch, ain't nobody trying to sneak in here. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I had better things going on a Sunday night than sneak in here. Nigga, tell me put a mask they on. They legit was on it like, yeah, ain't no wristband. You cannot be sitting down. But listen. Like, you gotta, yeah, so people standing up. My, 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 dick, yeah. my biggest, yeah, people, it was standing room for some goofies. Niggas really came out there to stand the whole night. But my biggest th- gripe with the shit was the presentation. Yeah. That was my biggest gripe because you, you stole my fucking moment. <laughs> you still, I just want to see my listen. I've never seen my name in lights. <laughs> this nigga said, "Man, I want." Yeah, and in the midst of all that shit, like yeah, my nigga swallow, put the swallow said, "Bro, that shit." That's, that's all. Oh, they, yeah. they, they, I can't go home and prove it. Like, oh, then who is that? Because that, that's what you do when on you watch, everything. When you watch a war on songs, everything. Like, oh, on everything. Like, okay, who is that? Motherfuckers might go serve motherfuckers might whatever, but it's like damn, motherfuckers ain't even give us the benefit of the doubt. Well, yeah, I'm a, like, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna tell you, man. So they gave some kind of awards, yeah. and I'm telling you, man, bitches don't look like they look on the internet. <laughs> man, Listen, I don't got Ooh, no fucking relationships like this. They be better than they appear. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna tell you, man. This ain't this ain't on this, but they had another one motherfucker, man. She's so social media. I think like social media popular. What are you talking about? Uh, Brooke Nation. Nation. You know what the fuck I was talking about. I told you at the show. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> you like that, nigga? Yeah. Oh, say, say your name, nigga. Say your name. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, bro, you know me too good, bro. You know me too well. I've seen her a couple pictures and shit. And hey, I'm like, look, man, I thought we, she looked we, decent. We, we man, thought we just. Bitch, like she on drugs. <laughs> she Not drugs. like bad, bad drugs, but some drugs that make you walk slow and shit. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and ain't Katie no, Supreme. She's on that yeah. that That's what it was. But she got up there and I, I was like, man, she doing good. She doing everything. Some What's not even bitches doing, man? Some be drinking and lean like niggas. That shit. Bitches might <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> be burping and lifting her leg up and farting for all I know. Oh, shit. But look, all jokes aside, she uh, she was like, period. After she won, what the fuck ever she won all her was period. And mm-hmm. bitches. That's all her. I said, I thought I was going to be able to turn this into the source of words if I get angry. I said, but this already <laughs> fucking murder dog sent you. This the sauce award. No, this is murder dog, nigga. <laughs> this is murder dog. This Mad dog 2020 listen. award. I feel like we is the Cabrini Greens. <laughs> <laughs> and then shout out to the what's the girl name? Nigga, that's what that was. Pitbull award. Neat, neat pit freak. Loose Pitbull award. The neat freak, the neat freak chick. Shout out to her. She was on my show before. Cool chick. She hustled. She got some award, nigga. They had her on speakerphone. Except her award. I said, what, where the fuck are we? <laughs> I said, yeah, where in the yeah. fuck are we? Yeah, just on speakerphone. So listen, I'm going to ask you. Sprint chip. Uh, if, this is my shit, if this is my award show, I will run my shit classy as fuck. You know what I'm saying? We should host a award show. I thought about it. We wouldn't nobody be here but us. But we would get all the awards. <laughs> I, I guarantee you we get at least 10 awards that night, nigga. But you know what? The competitor in me said, so I could do way better than this. I said, I could do way better than this. They, How many awards have another they had? Positive, they had, like, they had good, like, pictures. I know they're going to get some good-ass pictures. Shout out to Drew. Drew was out there taking pictures. 
I done seen him a worker, man. I done seen him do pictures and videos, so I know he gonna make this shit look like. Like, he gonna like, have this shit looking like, you know what I'm saying? Damn much of the win. Yeah, he gonna have, on everything, shout out to him, shout out to the whole event, but if I'm just being honest, I did put a little sauce in this shit. It ain't as bad as, as I'm saying. It's terrible. <laughs> but the shit could have been way better. If right. you care, people use the excuse that we had the COVID. Listen, we all make adjustments. Juvie said earlier, we still grind. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Our quality and shit, I mean, we ain't getting it like we was. But we consistent, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And we put our work in. And when you put your name on something, you have to, you know what I'm saying? You have to represent your it's brand the best. Right. Because if you just worry about selling tables and getting money, what happens, happens. Can we talk about that uh, menu again? <laughs> <laughs> we want to talk about the smoking pork chops. I mean, let's talk about the $25 I'm in my motherfucking mama. I'm in my monologue. <laughs> like, out of tone down and shit. I'm a little bit more serious. Like, well, listen, no, I'm that. like this. But then I'd be like this. Because you got to take care of your brand. When I, when I turn it down, they the six and shit. I'm serious. You know what I'm saying? Now you talk about menu. What was you saying about the menu, nigga? Back up to me. The, the, the thirty dollars CBD. No, 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 no. Hold on, because you didn't see this, Jason. Listen, and I was almost at home, yeah. but I had never had that shit, so I wasn't even for no man. Man, I was on the side of shit. Much. Yeah, yeah. What the Especially fuck? Especially to be in the goddamn gym. <laughs> we in the gymnasium damn near yeah, and shit. Yeah, we in the church pool pit. Well, <laughs> we in the bank with, uh, You love to hear that fucking Nike commercial where they just be Basically. dribbling and shit back in the day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not about to hit a thirty five dollar meal of basketball sand. You in the middle of your fucking food and the motherfuckers say, period. That shit is scary, nigga. You know you can choke on a thirty five dollar fucking sandwich. That shit was not a gala, sir. So that was not Listen, a gala. Listen, I'm gonna tell you gala price for uh <laughs> That shit could have been way fucking on everything. <laughs> Shout out to you though, because you don't know where the gay lead is, where that term come from. <laughs> Go study Gayla Priest. Shout out to Corey GQ for his I had him looking this shit up. Go look up the Gayla Priest and you're going to see why you don't want to go to no Gayla. Unless you want to be a gay <laughs> <laughs> The Gayla Priest, see where that shit come from. Overall, it was a fairly underwhelming night. Shout out to uh, Jason, uh, Keith. And uh, tears for coming through and kicking it. I really dragged y'all to my uh, pit of misery, and yeah. I'll do it again. Cause if they don't hear this shit, I'm going back next week, next year. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm having everybody vote. Did you, you, get, come, did you get nominated last year? Nah, but I wasn't. I didn't. I'm like, okay, let me get into this nomination. People were telling me congratulations for getting nominated, right. but all nomination was all your friends hitting. It's not like people actually out here listening. And, and it's a good look. It's, yeah, it's a fantastic look. Especially they put your name on the screen while people are looking. But, <laughs> but it, it all comes to a popularity contest. I guarantee you that the, most of the people didn't win based on votes. I guarantee that shit. Um, it is what it is. As far as the category, I'm disappointed Tyron didn't get the most slip on. Shout out to Jamal. I didn't see Jamal there, but shout out to Jamal. He like six foot twelve, and I didn't see him. I, 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 I <laughs> chopped it up with him. I get to see him. Um, <laughs> I really didn't see too many people who I fuck with though. Tyron, shout out to Eli Artain. He was in a drunk in the motherfucker. Was he? He was scary drunk. I was. Was he? Tyron gave me the biggest hug ever in my life. I gave him a hug. On everything. <laughs> <laughs> on everything. Hey, y'all saw Pat when I was recording that video and I was shooting that. And listen. Hey, that nigga scared the shit out of Hey, I'm like, hey, that nigga about to, hey, that nigga pull that blinky out and shoot my ass right now. He only gave I, me the biggest hug. Like, he hugged me like he found out somebody in my family who I cared about dog. He held me. <laughs> he held me. <laughs> it's the difference between getting hugged and getting held. Like, like, listen, if I can say this, man, I'm a pause. Oh, no homo. Man. But he almost swept me off my feet. <laughs> <laughs> like my back foot kicked up, nigga. Like we oh. <laughs> <laughs> Like he was a soldier and he was just getting all the shit and I ran over. I'm like, it's like I'm like trying to use a plan. He bring me in and shit. He embraced me. Then you I heard, said, then I you was, heard. All across the oceans and blue. I don't even know. No, no. <laughs> listen, listen, but that's how I heard it. I ain't no For words. You, I uh, <laughs> I've never felt so secure in my life. <laughs> All my insecurities washed away with that hug. I've never been. I've never Bro, been a hugger. Man, oh, listen. You, stop, tell, stop, you ever stop, see somebody stop, get stop, fucked up? Stop, and then, man. like, you know, like, somebody going through hard times and you hug them? 
And then like you going through our time, the hug don't you like get the fuck off me. Like the hug don't do shit for you. Like I'm I'm unhuggable. You can't hug me out of my sadness. Nigga hell you held you. That shit felt like a band-aid, nigga. I've never felt so that secure. That nigga post game, uh, NBA. Listen, game. Uh, right? That nigga game, 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 that nigga Man, I'm <laughs> Listen, nigga, a fucking John Woo dub should come out right now. That's man. the first that's time in nearly 30 years I've been held. Oh, I've never been held. Bro, I'm telling you, hurt, man. man. And, and I had to hit him hey. up the next day. Hey, I said, bro, did you mean a hug? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he said he had to call him the next day. Because you sober now, nigga. Do you really love me that much, my nigga? Do you love me? I ain't want to give you a chance to not call me the day after. <laughs> no, I just texted. I said, nigga, you was fucked up. He said, LOL, I know. I left it at that. I ain't want him to say, but the, that hook was real. <laughs> you can see that text. And he would say, you would have definitely started off with whole ass. Thing. But look, though. No. Uh, I just realized yeah. I'm back on the menu. Nigga, they didn't even have no hot dogs. And they had a whole section for hot dogs. How you can't have no fries, no and chips. Then, listen, listen. <laughs> no chips. Yeah, you can't even get no chips. Now, we are mentioning That's the coming. fact that they, we it's COVID. With that said, they are tripling up on food stamps. So fool should not have been excused this go round. Aldi, nigga. I'll guarantee you. <laughs> listen, Aldi, I, I shit you not. <laughs> just judging from the climate of the crowd, the periods that I heard. It was, at least, <laughs> it, was, it was at least 50 EBT cards in that fucking video. It was at least 50. With, with at least three other dogs on each. Nigga, I done, so, like, nigga, I done threw a $20 birthday party off some Aldi, nigga. It was like $15,000 worth of EBT credit in that bitch, man. Oh my and y'all got to go eat smother turkey. <laughs> and look at the bottom. This was smother annihilators on that motherfucker. <laughs> Shout out, shout out, listen, listen, listen. They had no water though. Oh, yeah. listen. They, they had, had water. water. They, they had water. Hold on, they had water. Dollars, but but when I got to the line, they had ran out of water. So I had to go over there and buy oh, a fucking a coke from the liquor place. I had to get the coke. I fucked up like they like well, mix them. I said we ain't the last coke away to that sober motherfucker. So I was that nigga who took the motherfucking last coke. That bitch said eight dollars. I said for this coke. She said. Yeah. yeah, I said you put some alcohol in it. She said no. Nah. I said I just see you go back there. She said you said crown and coke, didn't you? I said my son, you deceitful bitch. I said no, nah, I don't drink. I said I just want my coke. And she said oh, and she just stood there. And I just so she was gonna lie about the alcohol. Like, I didn't see the bitch go over there and get the coke. The, 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 the roof your roof of your ass, nigga. Mm, the sober ass. <laughs> the bitch tried to kill my good my good reputation. She tried to put dirt on my name. But anyway. Mm. Listen, she gave me this little ass cup of coke, that can of coke, and that ice. That shit lasted. I made that shit last. Mm -hmm. And then bitch eat ice like oh, they can say. I got them two do them tacos was okay though. Even though you said they were cooked. Now the meat was good. I don't know if it was because I was that yeah. hungry though. I was like, So you really can't jump on our chip? Uncooked. Yeah, it was raw. Yeah. Yeah. It's like eating flour. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Bro. Oh, you talking about the bread? Yeah, get it how we live, bro. Like, yeah, you was in Mexico eating butt, and you talking about. <laughs> <laughs> you thought we forgot about that? Guy? <laughs> hey, man, that was an experiment. How dare you? Hey, 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 you can afford to go to Mexico. Overall, oh, though, it's 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 okay. Okay. You can eat tortillas. You really eat tortillas. You can go to Mexico. You can go eat undercooked bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Hey man, come on man. Podcast ain't got to know about this shit. That happened in episode one or something. Right, right, right. <laughs> yeah, one time. Everything. Everything. Oh. One time for Mexico. <laughs> 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 Go back and watch that episode if you have One everything. One yeah, thirty four. I mean. But all jokes aside though, man, that shit was lackluster. It was you can tell I mean cause that's, that's, that's all jokes aside is lackluster. Yeah, you know, that nigga been all lackluster. That ain't, side no, was lackluster. That ain't no slander. I'm not like even I'm not I'm not like, being funny. So I'm on a scale of one to ten. They just wanted to go through with it. 
I you said three. You said three. I feel like they just really wanted to go through with it. They did. They want to make that little money. So they forced it. The skill. They forced the hell out of it. Hey, nigga, she do be on. She do be on Facebook talking about nigga. I had paid lights this month. COVID fuck. I'm like, damn. You be telling all the shit. You gotta die. You gotta die in peace. You gotta die in peace, man. Ain't nobody gotta know you dying while you dying. That's all I say, man. Take that massive heart attack like a real nigga. Don't even tell nobody you've been to the hospital 10 times and told you if you don't stop eating red meat, you're going to die. Just let him be surprised. He ain't even know. I knew. I knew. <laughs> I do. You know. But, but, a scale of 1 to 10, man, I'm going to tell you, man. Damn, we really pausing for this shit, nigga. You had to think about this. This should be quick, nigga. <laughs> oh, it was a lot of them, too. I'll give that shit a three, man. Oh, I'll give that shit a Jay. three. It wasn't fun at all. Like, I'd have been in bad place if I managed to have fun. I didn't have a good time. Mm. I didn't have a good time. I, I, damn. It was good to be around your friends, but it was only so much just so I could look at. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, the funnest part was terrible. One to ten, it was terrible. Um, <laughs> I don't <laughs> it's a 10. <laughs> <laughs> 10. Right. I wish I had four hands. It ain't personal. So I can get him tennis. No. Four times. <laughs> but no, <nah>, um <laughs> just outside of like you said, all the other shit, man. It just could have oh, been presented God. better, like in the light of all the fake uh enlightenment and fake woke and fake uh black unity and black power. Like that shit, the presentation should have been better, like more respectable. You know what I mean? Like if it was an actual award, like I just, I thought it was, I thought it was gonna be a little bit more respectable, even though whatever the music type music people make, like I thought it was gonna be classier. It really did. I thought it was shit for who's the DJ? I don't know, but he was playing God. Was it a DJ no, again? Or you know, okay, okay, it might be no. It was the they had might a, have been a laptop. So. They had we live in some somebody place. playlist was shitty. Nigga, they had like eight DJs trying to get an award but didn't want to hire. Okay, yeah. yeah. Cold. Oh yeah. And you know they got this one. Zero, nigga. I'm gonna get that one. Zero, and I wasn't even there. This man. Hey man. We live, in, we, live in, <laughs> hey, we, live in, we live in some weird times, man. Man, that's stupid fucking times. Stupid fucking <laughs> shit. Stupid fucking times, stupid man. Stupid idiot. I told Jason, too, I don't even want to give us no energy on here, but I told Jason, a particular sucker was going to try to <laughs> pull some bullshit after the show when it happened, just how I predicted. Right. I'm going to wrap y'all about that off air. Hey, man. But, you should have said, I gave that motherfucker a smothered three. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we got to put some smother on that shit. Well, there ain't any smother is the new word. There ain't smother. Hey, man, see if she let you smother. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nigga, I don't want no regular pussy. I want some smothered smother. pussy. Yeah, it got to be smothered with vagina. Smothered pussy. Smothered pussy. It's wet, nigga. It's smothered. Hey, oh, Do she say where is it smothered? Yeah, it is. <laughs> Hell no, nah, that's funny as fuck, but, man. But, but, but man, shout out to the League Awards. Uh, yeah, shout out to them, man. Yeah, I had no idea what to expect. She was built like Majin Buu. She was. Oh, you said what? You said what? She was built like Majin Buu. Who said that? Who said that? I had to delete that. That shit crazy. She looked like Sage Entertainment. Who she looked like, man? I did not see this through the mask. I could not see there were masks stuff because they want to get yelled at. Do you think so, Dave? Huh? You think so? She looked like Winnie the Pooh at the time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and tell me, does Cedric the Entertainer look like Winnie the Pooh at the time? <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, hey, beautiful young lady, Black Queen. Yeah, definitely. Black anyway. Queen. Hell yeah. <laughs> I know her. From one Black King to another. Oh, I ain't seen the magazine. Let's we'll zoom through this one, these couple. We ain't even a magazine. So Harry Tubman, your cool. boss. Friend or foe? Harry Tubman? Yeah. Kanye said that she didn't free the slaves. She just brought them up here to work for other white people. Hey, hey, man. man, you got to see. Man, man, oh, hey, sometimes hey. I thought about it, and I'm like, he, he damn near fucking right. Kanye but, but, then, but then you got to think. She don't fucking know. She's just trying to escape. Mm -hmm. But well, we escaping to nothing. You know what I mean? Like, So say I'm in, I'm in America, right? We get enslaved in America. It's like 10 of us. And they like get us, and they're like, we bring us to America, and then we in this whole church situation, and then I find a way out. And then I find a way out to work, and we 
go off to Colorado, which is a free land. Nigga, we still in America. We all pay taxes. I get a job. I don't have shit when I got out that motherfucker. You see what I'm saying? So, like, I get what he's saying. But then it's like, nigga, we still in this motherfucker. So, it's like, he, he halfway right, but he was just, it was just about how he translated. That nigga yeah. just need a translator. Like, yeah, like, anytime yeah. he say some shit, we gotta. Just, but, see, what Kanye meant to say was, yeah. his, his, was he, his intentions were well. He halfway right, but it's just like, like, it's just like how he said it, and then how everybody took it. Cause, you know, nah, that's, that's, sense man, that chick, though, you know she was like, all right, get the fuck out of here. She was like, yeah, so we gotta get the fuck out of Like, bro, I mean, but it's just how he said it. He's right, though. You know what I mean? Like, we still working for these motherfuckers, but we here. You know what I mean? Like, we not free, we free tech me with hey. I'm like, why though? Why what? Why are you no. saying that right now? Who ordered to? I don't know. But why? I mean, I don't that know the context. That was my thought. Because, like, like, what's the context of the whole thing? Because we only getting the sound, boy. That's, that's what I'm like. But did you that's check the logic? That was Twitter? what I thought. Hey, Kanye, you you didn't see the shit? I saw a lot of Twitter, Twitter, a lot of the tweets, and I'm like, Man, why? What was he saying? He was talking about his wife, talking about how they was, uh, why don't kill the baby? Somebody trying to come get him with a doctor or some shit like that. Because he was crying on baby. The only motherfucker that came to get, come visit me was uh, Dave Chappelle in Wyoming. He a real one. That's what he said. I'm glad you said Dave Chappelle. He said, Dave Chappelle said, said go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No, I, I wasn't even, I didn't even have a, a, a complete tweet. Oh, I was say something. Back in time and started talking about shit like. Hold on, this is totally off the script, but on God. I went to Pure Passion East like two weeks ago. Come on, man. Not right now, Nate. <laughs> one of Not right now, up, Nate. Uh, one of the bitches had a mask. She was dancing. And a thong, nigga. She was dancing with. Oh, that's a thong? That's a thong. Shit, mine was just yeah, a right. fucking. Uh, oh, my did, it, did, it, did, it, did it make you want to wear that particular mask? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to motherfucking know what that Nigga, that was a pad, like. nigga. That was a pad, nigga. <laughs> About. That was a pad. That was a pad. That was a yeah, That was a mask. Look though, look though, look though, look though. Right Yeezy. Kanye, first of all, with Dave Chappelle said that the worst thing you can do is diagnose somebody as being crazy without sitting down and listening to the fuck they say. Crazy is like he said, it's too dismissive. It's just like anytime somebody says something that's supposed to status quo, they damn crazy. Kanye West, Kanye West. If you get somebody who's gonna translate, it take away who Kanye West is. Mm -hmm. It take away what he talk, Kanye West know exactly what he doing. These dudes are all actors. This is a fucking stage. He's playing his role. He's a, he's chaotic. Hey, cause this nigga did say everybody know the movie Get Out is about me. That was one of the tweets. Yeah, <laughs> that's what he said. He tweets just random shit. Bro. I mean, I mean, everybody say this, but everybody say he's been with the Kardashian. He changed since he got the Kardashian, so that's but not far fetched. Yeah. Everybody say that about him. Like, yeah, once you fuck the Kardashians, your life fuck up. That's the that's what everybody say. Like the only nigga that so that's not got far over on the Kardashians was Ray J. And help that nigga. Yeah, that nigga got off. He got I'll over Ray J. Y'all fucking Ray J. But, but I, I, I challenge everybody here to go through and actually study Harriet Tubman. She knew exactly what she was going to, what was going on up here. It's easy for us to castigate anything going back then because we looking through it through a pair of eyes and shit that wasn't going through what they was going through. So it was the symbols of freedom up north. Mm -hmm. But you still was under white rule, right? White subjugation. That's what Kanye's saying. He not saying they was still... But I mean, because they was getting beat, raped, and lynched up here. It's lynching stories up north. That, there's no fucking an invisible line that's really mm -hmm. dividing America no. to where it was good down here. That's the shit they sell you and shit on a fairy tale. Yeah, there was no, yeah. this is fucking captivity no matter where the fuck you was at. Damn, they was hiring, they was hiring them Indians, the fake Indians to get your ass. You know what I'm saying? Everywhere we turned, there was somebody trying to fuck with us. Kanye West just is who he is. He a goofy. He on here crying. He's on the campaign trail. You know what I'm saying? So that's part of what he's doing. But that nigga he jumped off, that. though. I killed my daughter. I could have killed my daughter. That shit didn't sound. He, he, he said, but he talking about because he had told her to get the plan B. He was trying to kill the baby. This is, I'm going to tell you, it's like guilt. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of guilt in what he's doing, what he's saying. It shit. is. It's like, he know he done fucked up and he know his end is near and he's trying to guess let And you don't know who his friends are. Like, who are his friends? You don't I seem don't like, know. he seem like. He ain't got none. It, it, you, know, you don't confine in the world like this. How is nigga a billionaire? What you mean? Ain't he a billionaire? I don't know how much money nigga got. Cause he was in debt one, one round. But that's what they say though. Shooting. This is all headline. Like, how will we actually know? Cause usually niggas who got that kind of money don't spend their own money, so it's really hard to go in debt. Mm -hmm. You dealing with investors and shit like that. You ain't really fuck with your own money. Yeah, you're not explaining. I don't know, man. I don't. I, like I said, like I said this from Jump Street. 
21? That she's going she's gonna to get that nigga killed. Who? Who you think? Hmm? This nigga got all fucking secretive shit. <laughs> Who killed? Killed. Yeah, that shit might actually happen. Killed. He doing it. But no. <laughs> another one of the tweets was like, uh, you were, he like, I died before you see uh, uh, one of his kids modeling some cl- some clothes like how. He basically, what did he say? Hold on, I'm going to tell you exactly. This nigga say, this nigga say, <laughs> this nigga say uh, I put my life on God. The North's mom would never photograph her doing Playboy, and that's on God. I'm at the ranch. Come get, come and get me. He said what now? <laughs> he said I put that. I put my life on my God. The North's mom would never photograph her doing Playboy, and that's on God. I'm at the ranch. Come and get me. You okay? And that's equivalent to what we talked about earlier. My daughter will never. Share the League of War stage with me and shit. Koi star trophies in the air. <laughs> 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 that's the same shit, nigga. He's saying, man, like, you don't want to be in that. He might be referring to somebody. He said, come and get me. This is the exit. This is like Pusher said. Mm. And, and what's lost in this is shit is uh, that Drake this Pusher and Kanye again. Again? Again. He, uh, that was one of his tweets. This, uh, this the shit where you, they talking about you did the uh, Arabic speaking and shit. Oh yeah, but they said, but it, but the shit be so convenient, man. How you I like say that shit like the WWE. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It, it is, WWE, it is. Man. Listen, niggas with that kind of money aren't mad at each other for real. Nah, you too rich to be mad at niggas seriously. You know what I'm saying? Right. You can wake up and ride your elephant to the restroom. How <laughs> <laughs> mad can you be, nigga? Be mad, mad is getting up. Oh. Listen, we mad. I get up at 7 o'clock in the morning and hate where the fuck I gotta go. So, you expect me to be out here beefing with niggas and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But, with that said, though, um, <laughs> Kanye, man, he's in a terrible place. And there, that get out, it conceivably could be about him. It seemed logical to me, but I don't know what it means. Like, from his point of view, what are you saying? Right. Um, don't know what he means. I'm speaking in the second, fifth person. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so, um, Nicholas. Did we talk about Nicky last week? Nicky, uh, Ken. Mm-hmm. Nicky Minaj? That ain't my baby. <laughs> I thought you were talking about them bad pregnancy pictures she took. Who we talking about? Is it real? What? Nikki? Yeah. Who was she pregnant by? Hold on. First Average off. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. This, is, this is, for a short time, this is the black view. We gonna get some bitchy shit if we gonna be talking about Nicki Minaj and who she pregnant by. I mean, I don't I know I warn everybody listening. First off, let me add this is a disclaimer. I was talking about Nick Cannon. But right. I know what Nick was in front of Nate's mind, so we're gonna indulge him, so he can get it off his chest, so he gonna be out here ranting about Harry Tubman later. Put me on. Nick even now, Nick even now. I just got so many punk ass. What kind of mother would she be? Let's just go to Nick Cannon. What kind of mother would she be? Yeah. In the words of Pimp C. She gonna be a real live whore fit the prostitute. <laughs> In America's eyes, she's gonna be a fit mother because she has enough money to pay for real that Real shit, real shit. That shit was all esophagus. <laughs> well, I mean, because fuck them. Because they had right. they skewed this shit, man. But, would uh, you would you, would you, you like to have been the father of that child? Of Nicki Minaj? Yes. yes. Yeah, I, would, I wouldn't mind. I mean, yeah. I all that slander, and then this is how you yes, retreat. You this is a business. Your big, this country I'll is take, a business. Look, nigga, I'll take Bigfoot. Uh, yeah, we live in America. Too, man. Nigga, if we living in America, yes. Melvin the Mule. Fuck that. Hold on. How? Fuck Nick Cannon. Nick Cannon got bucked, bro. They they made, made that nigga bow down to the point where, listen, what they talking about, he's saying, basically, I ain't talking about y'all. I'm talking about the white people. I'm talking about white supremacy. People don't understand that Jews don't consider themselves white people. White people don't consider themselves Jews. Mm-hmm. This is a hierarchy. Black liberals, white liberals, Jewish liberals. That's how it all. So Nick Cannon, he trained enough to think that we supposed to assimilate with them. I'm done talking about Nick. He's useless. He embarrassed yeah. me. He embarrassed me. He, he, he out of here. He out of here. He's, he out as they've been saying this whole time, he is canceled. 
That nigga ain't canceled. That gave him the most listen, press for his. I'm talking about from shit. my perspective. One time, yeah, from uh, mine. Like I was, I, I mean, was kind of like, I was he's less than R. Kelly for me. I was borderline fuck with you for a little bit. Like, okay, Nick, cool. Like you really using your your platform, you kind of talking some shit. But then he was just like, the powers to be put their foot on his neck, and then he did what everybody else did. So it's like. To. Yeah, you canceled for real, for real. He's I'm done. Y'all straight up just personal. Oh, like, oh, celebrity kill, but for yeah. real, like, I ain't fucking with Personal, that, personally, yeah. it's, it's, it's always been Nick Cannon. Fuck Nick Cannon because of some personal shit, like, back in the day, but... This nigga, uh, your bitch nah, this nigga trying to take my skits. Might as well have been my bitch. This nigga trying to take some sketches from me. For real. Yeah, and then want to uh put it, get, break no bread with a motherfucker. But uh, as far as this shit go, I had never seen a fucking episode of Cannon's Class. Maybe. So Maybe. the amount of views that that shit generated, and they might continue to follow this motherfucker Jeez. to try to make sure he's not saying no shit. Like he gonna keep. His shit gonna, his brand gonna be fine just as the same as it was. Yeah. No, it ain't. Uh, no, but he just don't have, no, he just don't have no other platform. He don't have a mainstream see, platform. But the thing about right. Nick Kennedy is he got other people. That's he what I'm saying. He, he got, got everybody else. He didn't have he, to do he, 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 he didn't put so many fellas on him. Yeah. That they gonna stay fucking with him. But they did fuck him on the wild and out shit, though. He fucked himself. Yeah. He ain't no victim. He fucked himself. I'm gonna tell you, man. This is why I know they got so no. I mean, like, the rights to the shit. This one, he could have just come back and did something else oh, with a different name. That's not his shit. That's, they took that he could have did something else with a different name. You so, think Cannon? So plus, I thought he was that. That's some funny shit. Probably. That's one of the funniest Probably. things I ever seen, nigga. Nigga, if Look, I see that shit, we, we, in ten years, Nick Cannon's a white man. That's how history do. You think Nick Cannon was a white man <laughs> ten years from now? All right. But. I watched the clip of that shit. It was disgusting because he looked like he was down there bootlicking the Jewish white man looking at him like you ain't shit. Y'all see the clip? He looking at him like, bow down to me, boy. Oh, he had yeah. one of them on his show? That's who he had. A rap man. He fagged the rap fuck out of him. I yeah. didn't watch the, that. I watched, yeah, the, I watched probably about five minutes yeah. of it, man. I, I couldn't watch that shit. I what do you think Griff right. think about that nigga? I, who? What do you think Griff think, think about that nigga? Oh, Griff, it's, just like it's, business. Business. it's business. Uh-uh. Oh, then they just like Chuck D. Yeah. That's how I think. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, but he was gonna do that. I knew he was gonna do something. On everything. <laughs> you know, it's the, the thing is though, it's disgusting. Why? It's painful to watch. If you a real nigga trying to watch that shit, it hurts your fucking stomach. Cause he on there acting like you remember when you was young and you ain't know how to ask around a pretty girl like you really wanted some pussy. Yeah. You didn't know what to do. You felt like you were gonna say some silly shit. But you just start doing. Some well, you get giddy, get to giggling, and everything this bitch say. No matter how stupid what. Oh my hair. <laughs> Your hair, your hair. Yeah. That's what your hair, hair. But you cute with a hair head. You start saying, yeah, that's yeah. how Nick was. Yeah. He's so fucking giddy. Like, he over there fawning over this. That's why I'm saying we more like than we more. Like, the Honorable Minister Farrakhan, he don't represent all black people. It's like he was on, like, it was the most disgusting shit, but I wouldn't mind. Well. I'd rather watch a fucking police brutality video. Than <laughs> That's why I didn't watch no shit oh, like God, that. You know, I'm like, I can't I mean, watch no you know. insincere apology by a nigga it ain't just who it. shouldn't even been apologized you know in the saying? first place. Jump Street. Have you? Exactly. But <laughs> it, it's just how he bound down, man. Yeah, I know if, what you're saying. That's why it's painful. painful. If y'all can power go and watch five minutes of it. He might go <laughs> power through. He might go I'll kind of, hey, hey, I'll YouTube skip. Like this real quick. I thought when my finger stopped, that nigga was gonna be sitting on his lap, stroking his fucking chin. <laughs> That's how sad that shit was. But look, we're gonna wrap it up on this topic real quick. Damn, man. Della Reese versus fucking Quick. <laughs> Eddie Murphy versus the. They said Lil' Ass Tory Lane popped Melvin. Yeah. Commonly known as. He said, calmly. Calmly, calmly What's that fucking thing? Meg, Meg, Meg. Hot girl, Meg. Hot girl, Meg. She got shot in the foot as the allegations go. They said, Tory Lanez did. They said, you, where you going? That's what they said. He said, where you going? And she said, I'm going where I want to go. Pop. You go with a limp. Vintage Harlem Nights in L.A. In L.A. too? Listen. They tried to make that shit it. sound like it was from Cheddar Bob, Plexico, Burr. They shit. love they wasn't in New York. <laughs> but listen. But shit. LA getting like me. Megan got shot in the foot. She went to the hospital. 
She she got pulled over. As social media goes, she got pulled over. Yeah, she got pulled over. Like, like she, man, when you driving with your left get, foot? Yeah, they made her get out of the car <laughs> and everything. That's when they, cause the police, that's when they found out she got shot. Are you driving with your left foot, bitch? Why you driving like this? They pulled over. Shot leg, bitch. What are you? You know how tall that bitch is? That bitch is just fucking accelerating with her fucking left arm. That bitch is sitting up straight, reaching the brake pedal and shit with that long ass. But, hey, but look, 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 that's irrelevant to the situation. Would you fuck? <laughs> That's irrelevant to the situation. We're talking about her. Nah, no, fuck that nigga. Nah, no, fuck that nigga. I'm not fucking no bitch. You wanna look at eye and shit when we first meet? This bitch, this bitch staring out shoulder to shoulder. We doing like this and shit to see who the tallest is. And she cheating. Hold on. She cheating so she doing this. You know, <laughs> motherfuckers they do it. They do that shit to see if they tall than you. She ain't be playing tall people games with me. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Then y'all niggas little. The only thing you and listen, Jason. The only thing that you and Megan Megan got in common is your shoe size. Both of you niggas were thirteen. <laughs> she be doing that nigga like this. On everything. On everything. She be man. So she be choking you, nigga. And now and then she was talking about she needed to be. Pro she wanted this to be protected to. by a, a man. She's man. this 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 is narrative about hey all jokes aside. We will be back on the jokes in a second. She may suppose, because you know what social media is. Anything bad happen, nigga, they gonna get you. So they can start laughing, joking, making the uh, home night memes and all this shit. And she make a post which black women aren't protected by black men. That is the most tired narrative out here right now. I'm gonna tell you what it is. These bitches wanna run contrary to a black man through social media all the time. The only time they in cahoots with niggas is that they get shot by the police. And it's narcissistic. They make posts and shit for attention to them. You know what I'm saying? Like, you would see a motherfucker post an ass shot and say, <laughs> no, no, uh, find Brianna Taylor killers. Boom. So you can get likes based <laughs> off that. This is how sick it is. It be your own yeah, shit, but you press a hashtag because these bitches are narcissistic. Protect it. How are you going to protect somebody that you think you, how, why do you want somebody to protect? Hold on. You think you better than this nigga, but you want them to protect you. You don't you don't want to listen, but you want to be protected. You want to be all oh, this. I can do everything on my own, but you want to be protected when it's convenient for you. You revert back to your natural feminine self to where you need that protection. But you've been online talking all oh, your shit, niggas ain't shit. I get money, eat my pussy, hot girl shit. And then you want a nigga to protect that bitch. You're not worth protecting. You protect valuable things. Right. If you have no value, I'm not protecting you. Ask any woman. Who is in a healthy relationship? Does she jive with that shit? She went, no, I ain't got nothing to do with me. Do you feel protected Just by your you. man? She's gonna say, yeah, I feel protected. But that like it's a kind of group thing where niggas not protecting righteous women. Righteous women always get protected. But you get what you give. She gets off that vibe and shit. Ain't nobody trying to be around that shit. You, you don't protect Megan. You shoot her in the foot. <laughs> you don't protect bitches that, like that. I feel like that bitch probably gave that nigga a pounce through that motherfucker. I'll guarantee you she is winning. Uh, a, a chair. She, she that nigga like said she was winning. That's why he popped ass. ass. That see. nigga. Yeah, and like, then look, he was reaching for the gun and shit. She stepped on his back and shit. He was really reaching the gun. I got a movie, nigga. And what the fuck I got to shoot you for real, bitch? But I'm so sorry, though. You your Listen, shoot you again. I'm tired of that black man don't protect black women shit. It is a particular black woman who's not protected. The ones who can do it on their own. The ones who are not compliant with the structure between men and women. That's just how it go. You a fucking renegade. You know what I'm saying? Real shit. You a nigga. big bad wolf, you bitch. Must, you must read that. Buy the motherfucker. Right. You must read Blow that. Blow a house down. I'll say what? You must read that Pippin Ken book or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah all the definitions of some renegade asshole. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. I got to read this off, though, man. So look, this is. You know, I follow Ratchet Ho. <laughs> but look, though. You're talking about online. Be, yeah, be online. The Ratchet Ho whisper. But look, though. But look, though. Because we got Cheetos. The homie <laughs> puts the Ratchet Ho in check, though. You want some With some real nigga shit, though. She yeah. ain't the, the chick, little dark skinned chick. She don't, you know. But let me, her post says, everybody swear they want, they want me, et cetera. But yet nobody want to date me. I'm confused. Who said that? This bitch said this shit. This okay. Is chick. okay, so this is the homie jumped in, and jumped in and said, you do know what that means, right? You feel me? Now, I'm thinking like the ratchet chick is going to be like, you know, yeah, I know what this means, period. This bitch really said, no, I don't. 
Man, old girl broke that shit down to her, nigga. I had to damn near Another girl did? Yeah, the, the, the same chick. She was like, can I completely be honest with you? Man, probably see it as a sex symbol. Someone they probably wouldn't mind having sex with or even chilling with. Most. Damn, this pose long to the motherfucker. It is, but hold I on. hope you, I hope you. Hold on, I'm get to. Oh. Most men from the club or street life just want someone they can floss with or sleep with on the low. Period. She I'm said like, period. Bitch said period. Damn. Men are always going to show interest because you look nice, young, and fun, but sometimes you too open on social media. I see that, and I'm a female, so I know they see it. And sexually, in a sexual way, which draws a lot of attention, right? I'm saying, I'm not saying you easy or nothing. Yes, the fuck you are. But hold on, hold on, hold on. But that's, that's she in my mind. She, she put it, it to her. Up. <laughs> said, I'm not saying you easy or nothing, but believe it or not, good men don't like wild slash drama women. I be watching your lives. I see what you be on. Okay, Quit. Raiden. Hold on. <laughs> Nigga, I said same shit. Nigga, I said. <laughs> <laughs> she wins. Right. Oh, quick tip. Real men who want to get to know you beyond sex last good time will do so. And make sure you are presenting the type of woman. She, hold on, hold on. Uh, she didn't say that. Can you please go with that again? She didn't say presenting. No, no, she said presenting. Okay. The type of woman they want to make a relationship with, too. Your faults. That's it. She First of all, what, what, what do the what, what do what do pretty I, much she said? What do Ayana look like? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck she look like? That's, about, that's uh, an ugly bitch speech. It <laughs> is. It's definitely is she chick, The chick that, that put her in place. Yeah. Oh yeah, she big, 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 big. <laughs> <laughs> she got Listen, that, she got listen. <laughs> but she cool as fuck though, cause she's cause she, she got to She has to sports, be. Nigga. What the fuck else she gonna be besides cool? Nigga, it's one Lizzo, nigga. Ain't room for two. Uh, <laughs> uh, nah, Lizzo. Ugh, I throw that bitch ain't out. Room for one, nigga. <laughs> it ain't room for one. Listen though, <laughs> but no, nah, this but this all jokes aside, right here. But hold on, you can be able to get to my point. Okay, my bad. So the, every post has been about I need to be on my shit, man. After that, after that, nigga, every post, nigga, every post. So you can turn this right. bitch from a. She, oh, raised, she raised us through a fucking a reply. Post, a reply. <laughs> That's what's up. Are we really. Is, is the world. It's sad, that, it's sad bro. It's sad. Like, That's it, not sad. That's beautiful. And it's That's beautiful cool. that she put it in her place, That's but a nigga cool. underneath her just had it. Put your cash app. I gotta send you that shit. That's what the nigga did. You for real. So the bitch actually didn't win. So it really Scarface still get killed at the end of the movie. Still got killed. Nigga still be. Oh, dear, at least. Nigga still had to push your cash at. But you know what, though? Tell me that pussy go. I wish I'd been on that, folks. We tagging it? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely. But listen, fat bitches got perspective that pretty bitches ain't got. Ain't gonna never Because she's never had the pretty bitch problems. Right. She's seen all the pretty bitches. Like, she got a hell of a view and shit. She's like the friend who. With you, who a nigga like, I'm not fucking her. She's her. <laughs> Nobody's running interference with you. She so, that, see that nigga who almost, who know what they would do if they won the lottery. She, she got nigga in to do it. Like, if, I had, if, she, if I was bad like you, she, <laughs> that bitch, that bitch is me when I was 14. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch is me. Like, I, I'm like, damn, nigga, you can't keep a bitch. We got a trigger right. <laughs> I got all the perspective, but I ain't got no bitches. So I got all the perspective and shit. All the perspective. That's this, sad, bitch, man. this bitch is a fucking swami. Like, this bitch is like a fucking yogi, a guru. This bitch is a, you a monk. So you don't be getting no pussy, but you know how to get the pussy? Just be one with the pussy, is. nigga. That bitch won't get the pussy all the way. She up. changed her life, listen, man. Bro, and she was nice with. This straight. is her revenge. You niggas ain't That's shit. That's her revenge. I guarantee you. I done passed up on That so burly many bitch things. be sitting around on social media waiting to catch a pretty bitch on her most vulnerable, st vulnerable state so she no, can no, tell it. Look, bitch, you too easy. <laughs> That's what she. She come over there, hey, hold your, hold your shit up. Do like this, you got to come in your lips. <laughs> <laughs> No, but that, uh, she probably secretly like that's some dope shit though. Yeah, that's dude. some dope shit, especially if she changed. <laughs> especially if she changed. But the only thing she don't, like the only thing ago. that she don't understand, and I'm sure is because you just made a new. Point. I don't know. I'm sure dudes do fucking inner tubes on her back. 
<laughs> that the object of every woman is to fuck them and then see if you like them. You see what I'm saying? That bitch has never been nothing but light. That bitch is like, hey, uh, Sharita, you got uh, $7,000 I can hold to, uh, get it back. That's who she is. You know what I'm saying? She that she nice. She give it to you. Man. Oh, she might give you eight. She a good faith motherfucker. <laughs> she, she, she believe in people. And when you that big, you believe in people, man. <laughs> <laughs> you believe in people. And, and you, you gain wisdom. Listen, every time a bitch get fucked by a new nigga, she lose some wisdom. <laughs> that bitch has never been fucked, so she still got all wisdom. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Like, yes. like, the wisdom ain't been fuck knocked stupid, out of her yet. Man. We saw it. said, fuck the stupid. Yeah. And and, and it, if you fuck with smart nigga, your, your, your intelligence increase where every time you get nutted in. <laughs> it's like, I see, I it's remember, a deposit. It's like you keep. And it exists in the positive. And, 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 and I'm being funny, but you build women up. Like, if you with a woman, you build her up. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? You knock all the dumb shit out of her. Boom. Cause she thinking that she worth more than her pussy, so you fucking her, you start knocking that shit out of her when she like that bitch. She down her ground zero. That bitch is nine eleven on nine twelve. <laughs> that bitch is. Nigga. She was <laughs> once slim. She was once towers, nigga. She's here now, and she don't know what to do. So now I take a nigga to build her up. It takes a black man to protect her. <laughs> <laughs> In the show right there, nigga. Hey, what's up? Nice, we are late to the motherfucker, man. Hey, bro, that was real. That was I had to read that. I want to read that, that shit. shit was that dope. shit, though. That I'm shit like, was dope. Man. Hey, give my best regards. Give my regards. <laughs> <laughs> they need to start a show called oh, Pretty God. Fat. <laughs> <laughs> every post has been, you know, a she, changed, she changed woman. Life, man. And then, nigga, literally five minutes ago. Names? <laughs> <laughs> just on social media, nigga. It ain't like it's in a DM. <laughs> the chick name, her name is Paige. Big Paige. Okay, Big Paige. No, no, no. You talking about oh, the chick that was didn't know. The hero. The hero? Oh, her name is, who's her name? Shanice. I've been sure to be. Nah, it's her name. niece. Ain't no <laughs> Her it's name a, is Sharice Pyle. It's a cute name. Give it up, Sharice Pyle. Yeah, she already saved the hoes. Saved the hoes, for real. Anything you got to say? I know you niggas ain't got no show. I love it. What? Oh, yeah, I, I mean that as a Freudian slip. I got one tomorrow. <laughs> how did your show go last week? Oh, it was awesome. It was ghetto as a motherfucker. It was League awesome. Awards. It was League Awards weekend. Nah, bro. It was, uh, it was a... They didn't practice social distancing at all. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't practice social distancing at all. It was a... They didn't practice social distancing at all. Fuck. Tell them about helium. Oh, That's another <laughs> thing. <laughs> but it was, you know, it was no mask on none of them white faces in the helium. Uh, you you no, know, I was just looking at the pictures on the internet. And I was like, these niggas ain't doing This is a all for show, nigga. This is a faux no, epidemic, uh, pandemic, uh, pre precautionary tale, nigga. I'm surprised this you shit. didn't get put in the showcase. I, I wasn't trying to be in the showcase. Man. Oh, you told them no? No, nah, I just wasn't trying to be in the showcase. It was... I. I just hadn't tried out for it. But. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about the content. I'm talking about like they had rent her up headlines. I'm trying to wrap the show up. Y'all have a personal conversation. Oh, yeah, we discuss this off the air. <laughs> no, no, no. Where's your show at? Yeah. Oh, show uh, tomorrow. I'm in uh, Fort Wayne. Uh, yeah. Fort Wayne Comedy Club? Nah, you know that shit closed down. It's down, down. <laughs> down how are they, how they doing? Down, like, they, any... it's, a, it's this place called the Mamba Room. You been there before? Nah, he just, it's like it's second night. He okay. just hit me up and shit Damn. to do his headline. Uh, That's what's up. You ain't doing shit? You yeah, uh, shit, August 8th. Hold on, he be inviting you and you. Okay, go ahead. Oh no! Nah, it's like he's asking me if I was asking if you ain't doing shit. But oh, that's just, me. Just uh, that full time dad and this shit, and being a, a camp counselor. Oh, you stuck? Okay. Yeah. What is that? Now, uh, you gonna go over your? I got a fatherly stunt on your. I'm taking care of my responsibilities, nigga. Uh, no, uh, that's, that's what they can say right now. They kill themselves. Now, uh, and they use ER at the end. Now, uh. uh <laughs> no, nah, I uh, got a show at uh, Teehees in uh, Des Moines, uh, Des Moines, Iowa. I was about to say Iowa. Uh, August 18th. You headline? Two shows. Oh, you I don't know if I'm headlining. Or you headlining? I'm just there. I'm headlining. You see, what, you see what the fuck you're doing? He's trying to stun on it. 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 You play a two ass nigga. That shit ain't even plugged in. Nigga, I'm plugged in. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, nah, you get in control, nigga. Yeah, Luigi gonna be in Ottawa. Follow, follow, <laughs> follow. Uh, make sure y'all follow Go Jason R on all social media. Uh, if you uh, got that, <laughs> Juvie. Man, make sure y'all check out the Casita Nobody episode week one thirty seven streaming on every platform you can possibly think of Cheer. tomorrow. Definitely. Another fantastic show. Thank everybody for checking out. Thanks for the homies for coming through. Yeah, that shit was fun. An uh, hour and a half. We an hour and a half and shit. Hey, two hours. Hey, motherfucker got, got the talking and shit. Nigga, really? this is a Scorsese film, nigga. Don't worry about it. This is a yeah. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. But no, man, like, shout out to the League Awards. Shout out to all the winners. Um, yeah. Shout out to that fantastic smother menu. <laughs> we'll catch y'all next That's week. The menu is smothered, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> the best podcast you ever heard of. Conceded nobody. Smothered paper. Face. The Conceded Nobody. Every Tuesday at 8 p.m.